Um, you probably saw Jacob, if you were at our event last month, doing juggling uh, with playing by air. Um, he's going to do something really fun for us and teach us a little bit as well. <coughs> Because the theme is education today, I thought I'd begin by sharing a little bit of the results from my research and completing my PhD in biomedical informatics at Vanderbilt University. ask, so you spend six years getting your PhD and now uh, that's what you do for a living? <laughs> They're surprised, but really, I'm only able to do what I do because of my education and how I was able to combine it with creativity and my sense of play. When I first started graduate school, one of my professors said, you know, the purpose of a graduate program isn't just about the findings and the papers that you write, it's about learning how to do research. And apparently I took that advice pretty much to heart because after I graduated, while I didn't continue to write papers on exactly the same topics, I used my same approaches to community building that I developed in my research to start my own entertainment company using comedy and circus. So it's pretty much the same things that I've always been doing, if you'll let me explain a little. Uh, my, the focus of my research was using community building methods to connect the local cancer support nonprofits, looking for new ways to connect them for partnerships and creating awareness for all the many resources available to families in the community. Now, as a social entrepreneur, I use creativity and entertainment to connect audiences and communities, to create awareness for causes in the community, and to bring laughters, laughter to families who need it most. So, what I'm doing now, for example, I will we'll use juggling to create awareness for a cause. We have a program called Catch It Early using juggling for cancer prevention awareness where we've uh, created videos. We run in cancer awareness races, adding an element of fun, but also helping bring awareness to the causes. And so it's, it's something that I've been able to take a hobby of mine that I've enjoyed since I was 10 years old, combine it with the theories and methods of my formal education into something that's a career, that's something I enjoy and love to do, and that's making a difference around the country with communities and families where we're going out uh, with our outreach work, as well as with our clients. So, with a, without a PowerPoint, I'll give you a visual demonstration of what it means to weave it all together. So again, I don't think that everyone has to go to graduate school to achieve their childhood dreams. But if we can find ways to encourage all individuals, from students 
to employees in the workplace to embrace their sense of play and creativity and give them opportunities to merge that with their formal education. I think that the final results may very well pleasantly surprise you. Thank you.